as Lee mentioned pre-game. Just to keep it out of the hands of May and Lever. He delivers it back inside 50. Big pack of players again. Pick it at the front. Couldn't control it. And this is what we think happened to Bailey Fritch. Maybe here. Landed awkwardly with that left knee, left ankle sort of area. He's in the rooms. We can't see anything going on there at the moment, but he is inside the rooms getting treatment. Play on! Bumped off balance in midair. This is good from GWS, though. That intercept by Haynes just to close the outlet, send it back in again. A lot of traffic inside 50. Grundy over the top, didn't get a fist to it, didn't impact the contest. And over the back, Callum Brown makes him pay. Yeah, look, it's a real, obviously, a Dow contest at the minute. He's picking. He can liven it up. Gets to 50, has some options. Melksham fresh on the ground. We'll go back from 35 out, more or less directly in front. As you said, his inclusion now with Fritch out doesn't change too much, but what an opportunity. Fifth AFL game of the season, first since round five. He's had a good season in the VFL, kicked 17 in the VFL, and he adds one here in the top flight. Spins away from Pickett. Ships down the line. That's tidy to, to Toby Green. Always looking to get on with it is Toby Green. That's 50 from Harms. So Toby Green going to go around the corner here. And he does. No problems. Very nonchalant. And he kicks the goal. The second for the Giants. Continues down the line. Melks some strong lead. Love the way Jake Melksham plays. Almost a 50 there. Melksham to Smith. Smith elevates. Almost. Neil Pullen as well was almost the side and centre getting it done. Under pressure here, the Giants. And it is a goal for Bowie. And Bowie has nailed it. Green trying to work through traffic. Did it superbly. Sold the dummy on Brayshaw, then delivers to Lloyd, who's 65 from goal. Under four minutes left in the opening half. Giants need some return on their investment in this second quarter. Lloyd will kick it long to the pack. Big fist from Pe Petty, but straight to Toby Green, and he snaps the goal. <laughs> Goal-saving effort, potentially. Rivers coughs it up. Still time. Green, two seconds. Toby sets sail for goal and misses. But he ties things up at the major break. End On the time. chest, Hogan delivers. Big fly will get to the back row. Halloran, can he step Hunter? Tackles him high in the process. As lucky Hunter has launched himself Thanks, at Xavier O'Halloran. Moved up perfectly. Green from the point of the square to Hogan. Out the back, didn't get there. G May defended well. He did not panic. Harms went the one hand. Couldn't pick it up. Through traffic is Ward. Squirted it to Kelly. And Kelly's got the bender. Sensational stuff from the Giants. Which is just creating turnovers and chaos. Joel Bowden there with Daryl White watching this game with interest. Canelio. Green. Brown, good ball, coming. Directly in front here, kick of 50 metres. This to make it four in a row for the Giants, and it is there. They've got 10 extra inside forward 50 to Demons, but just unable to generate more shots on goal. Clayton Oliver in the Melbourne coaching's box, and a little snap at goal there from Grundy. Finishes it off, and Melbourne in desperate need of that one. Rounds 1 to 10, ranked number 4 scores from stoppage. Rounds 11 to 15, ranked 17th. Clayton Oliver not responsible for all of that, but certainly a significant part. Oh, he's a huge cog, a major missing piece in all of that. Back come the Ds, Chandler. Neil Bullen to pick it. To bring the Ds back within one straight kick. Footy now gets back to the work, the front and centre. Nice little tap down there from Smith. Pick it in there again. Comes out Ward, trying to keep the ball moving, but straight to Brayshaw. Very clean is Brayshaw. Nice kick, good composure. Finds Langdon with a set shot. Shot a goal here. Two goals, eight this year for Langdon. 
comes in, so he hasn't been the most accurate, but that is online. That is there. That is unbelievable. To the road train end. Callahan. Callum Brown wants to take on Gorm. He spoke about his speed earlier. Delivers it inside 50. They've got options. Hogan in the pocket. Toby Green at the top of the square. Jesse will have to hold his run. In fact, it's Riccardi, rather. 13-7 for the season. 13-6 in the VFL. So 26-13 for the season at all levels. It's been finishing superbly. That one always left. There's the bout of McAdam stand in the background there. Gorn getting it into a dangerous position. An almost opportunity there for Chandler. Picked up there by Sparrow. Offline, but the point. Now Petrarca. Long towards Brown. Worked under it by Taylor. Ball in dispute on the deck. Well done, Taylor. Out to Angwin. Tom Green, been outstanding. Bends it down the line. Lovely kick finds Kelly. Kelly now on his preferred left boot. A thumping ball. He's looking for a slider. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's got it. He's got the slider. They hit the front, the Giants. Kelly. Massive contest. collision on the wing. Levers taken down. Now Brayshaw steps one. Dribbles a kick. Salem has to wait. Pokes it forward. Pickett versus Perryman. Perryman dives on it. Ball spills out. Neil Bullen snaps goalwards. Misses. It spills inside 50. Haynes has got to go. It's socket off the deck towards the pocket. Can Smith make something happen against Buckley? It's out of bounds rather than the behind. Uh, May's going to track back to the goal line to try and defend. Riccardi picks it up. Looks inside 50. Can Ward get there? Well done, May. Punched it away. Grayshaw, one last chance for the Ds, maybe. But they'll keep coming here, and they do with that man. High footy, they've got to go. McVee just has to launch. Viney's been a superstar today. We've got 20 seconds remaining in the game. Hunter's got the ball on the half-back line. They trail by two points, the Demons. Melton's going to have to work here. Haynes in front, won't let it go. They try and lock it up. But with just six seconds to go, I don't think they can score three seconds. Somehow we lost three seconds off the clock. I'm not sure how, but the Giants are going to win this game. Adam Kingsley, the coach, they will have won four out of their last five. And they are having a good second half year. 47-45.